Hey guys, Darren here. Welcome to Mayhem Country Living. Out traveling, doing a little bit of work today. I was wanting to talk to you about something I had seen. Uh, I broke down and watched the news. Holy cow. And uh, whether it's Fox or CNBC or ABC 3340, whatever it is you want to watch. Anyway, I broke down and watched the news. And I want you guys to understand the economy is doing better than it has in a long time. Consumer spending is up. We're doing great. Holy cow, really? Okay. And then they started uh, spouting off some numbers. And, and I, I remembered uh, a few of them, and I just want to uh, go over it and then I did a little bit of research the cost of a home interest rate has risen for someone with, with good credit um, looking to do you know conventional FHA depending on what you got um, the annual uh, the average interest rate has gone up from three and a half in 2019 to 2020 percent interest three and a half percent interest it's over seven and a half percent interest now it's a little bit of money now the cost of a new vehicle we're not talking about the interest yet the cost of a new vehicle has doubled in the past three or four years interest rate, now we're talking about the interest rate on the vehicles, has gone up considerably. <laughs> um, and you have to look at everything and wonder, and then, and then uh, you, the talking heads are going to tell you that, well, the, you know, spending is up. Americans have confidence in the economy. Unemployment's down. Well, yes and no. Mostly no. And then you start reading into uh, some other sites, and it turns out that most Americans are going through their savings, tapping into their 401ks, and pulling out whatever they can, taking loans out on their homes to pay for their regular monthly expenses. Is that not crazy? I was talking to a friend of mine on a fixed income. He and his wife both retired. And he said, I spent almost $1,000 on groceries just for myself and my wife last month. He said, that's cash out of pocket for everything for the month. He said, I tracked it all. And... I spent almost a thousand dollars. I said, well, what had it been previously? He said, well, we live pretty good, pretty easy, and we do a lot of home cooking. You know, we don't do a lot of the eating out or anything like that, or, you, you know, don't eat uh, a, a lot of, you know, fancy dinners, just good home cooking from scratch. He said, that's all we do. And I said, yeah. I, I, I said, and here's the kicker. I hate to be the bearer of bad news I said it's going to get a lot worse um, I said next year you'll probably pay $2,000 a month and that's not just him that's most every person that I know of even uh, the people who are on uh, who receive SNAP benefits and everything even I hear from them and everything the cost of everything has gone up and all the people, all the career politicians have done such a good job and turned the economy around, and we're all doing so well. You can go ahead and go across, buddy. I'm driving, so I'm letting the guy cross. And uh, you can go ahead, too. Yeah. Um, here in Alabama, we still wave at people when, not, when we let them through. But I know you guys don't believe it because I know you guys are in the same boat. 
and and i love it when i get the comments well you're just one of those rich white youtubers holy cow that's incredible rich white youtuber well let me tell you um everybody is feeling the crunch even this rich white youtuber how about that and i wish that was true um because the price of everything has gone up incredibly you can go watch the previous videos that i've done uh from when we've been going to sam's or walmart and everything and we compare the prices and i pull out stuff that i purchased a year ago from a deep freezer and it's twice as much now as it was then so if the economy gets any better we're all going to go broke that's what i might call this video but I know you guys are smarter than to believe the crap that you're being told. Buckle up, hold on, because it's going to get worse. Anyway, guys, I hope you're doing well. Hope everyone is doing all right. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. Share this if you would like. I hope you guys have a great day. And remember, there's people out there that are worse off than you. We have to start taking care of some of them. Take care of you people.